Hello, I hope you grow nice and yummy. Oh, you're that former soldier, aren't you? Cloud, was it? Former soldier turned problem solver. Are you okay, Miss Folia? You look upset. Uh, yeah, I am pretty upset. The kids are still off doing patrols, even though it's now time for their lessons. Not a single one of them has come back yet. Patrols? Is that a leaf house thing? Something they do to help out? That's right. In return for the donations we receive, the kids go around town picking up litter, running errands, that kind of thing. I don't suppose you've seen any of them, have you? <sighs> you see, I have some important plans this evening, and I really need to go and get ready. Would you like us to go round them up? Oh, that would be wonderful. There are five of them out on patrol right now. They all wear homemade swords on their backs, so they should be easy to spot. One boy patrols near some concrete pipes. One girl likes to do her patrols in public areas with lots of people. One boy spends most of his time checking out the shops. One girl loves to be fussed over by folks at the community center. One boy likes to stand guard at the town gate. And don't forget, they all wear homemade swords on their backs. Thanks again for agreeing to help you guys. Is this right? You could see the sky? Long ago, when the Sector 6 plate fell, everybody thought it was the end. The plate fell out of the sky? Just that once, and it'll never happen again. Wow! You're that soldier, right? Can I ask you a super important question? I heard bad people broke the Mako reactor, and there's gonna be another war because of it. Is that true? Who knows? But isn't there something else you should be worrying about right now? <gasps> I forgot about Miss Folia's lesson! I gotta head back to the house! The plate fell out of the sky? <laughs> oh. I thought we'd put those days of war oh. behind. Cloud? But hey there, how goes the patrol? There's a lot more people on the streets than usual. Maybe because the reactor blew up? Well, you've been keeping a very sharp lookout. But, don't you think you're forgetting something important? Oh, Miss Folia's lessons! I gotta get back to the house! And now, the weather report. Ooh. We're looking at another cloudy day in Midgar. Oh! With overcast you scared me! Tomorrow. Hey there, how goes There's the patrol? I've been watching them really close. I'm trying to learn all about the business. The you want to open up a shop of your own someday? And yeah, so I can earn lots of money and use it to help the house. The teachers don't like to talk control. about it, but we know the donations aren't enough to keep things running. Uh, but that's a secret, okay? I'm not supposed to tell anyone. Anyway, I gotta go study. Free of charge until they can find new accommodations. The city are also voicing their anger and outrage with Avalanche. Instead of our regular programming, we will be bringing... Hey there, how goes the patrol? Great! I've been picking up garbage and giving people directions. Plus I helped an old lady cross the street. You've been busy. It's a normal day for me. Gotta work hard. The house depends on people's donations. Oh no! I'm late! Did you see Miss Folia? Is she mad? Oh, I gotta go! I'm sorry! Hello, Cloud! Sir! It's a real honor to meet you! I think you soldier guys are awesome! I want to be strong and tough when I grow up, too! You sound very determined. These are dangerous times. A reactor blew up and a bunch of kids lost their friends and families. Who knows what might blow up next? 
I guess that means more children might be coming to the house soon. And I think the teachers are gonna have a whole lot more work to do. Speaking of teachers, Miss Foley is looking for you. Oh man, I completely forgot! I have to get back right now! That's everyone. Let's go back to the house. The children finally came back, thanks to you two. You've been a great help. Okay, everyone, come inside. It's time to hit the books. <sighs> you guys, the Toad King's back. I saw him near the hideout. We gotta do something about him. The Toad King? A weird, creepy monster we've seen near the hideout lately. He wears a crown and walks around like he owns the place. If he's not a king, he's gotta be monster royalty at least. I bet a soldier could beat him up easy. Oh yeah, real easy. But here's the thing. I don't work for free. Or cheap. But we don't have any money! The Watch wouldn't ask for money. But if we ask any other grown-ups for help, they'll find out about the hideout, and that'll be it. We really don't want to lose the hideout. Come on, help us! Oh, and we'll give you some cool treasure if you do. And if that's not enough, I'll pay the rest of your fee once I open my shop. Well, if you won't help, then we'll just have to kill it ourselves. <sighs> I'll do it for three gil. Huh? I'm offering a special discount right now on Toad King jobs. Looks like it's your lucky day. Awesome! Now that's my kind of bargain. I wish you luck, brave warrior. See me, be quiet. Leave this to me. I don't think so. Going in. See you around. Never in doubt. You're dead. <sighs> Try to stay behind me. That way I can cover your back. Going in. Brace yourself. Hm, nothing to it.
with more magic. Best do it right. Gotcha. Get him. Enjoy the ride. Go all out. That wasn't so bad. Eat the Toad King? Yep. Kicked his butt real good. Awesome! I knew you could do it! Now we don't have to worry about the king and his smelly friends. Thank you so much! Here, this is for you. The treasure we promised. It's definitely worth at least three gil. Okay, kids. Playtime's over for now. I've prepared a special assignment for everyone. One that I expect you to finish today. Understood? Uh, yes. Yes, Miss Folia. I appreciate you getting rid of the Toad King, by the way. Wow, Miss Folia. You must know all their secrets. Oh, if only. Easier said than done. They're always on the move, looking for new adventures, chasing new dreams. All while trying to make the lives of everyone around them just a little bit better. I try to make sure they don't stumble and fall. And when they finally do, I help them back up. Hmm. <laughs> Sounds exhausting. <laughs> Sometimes it is, but I want the children to know that until they can stand on their own two feet, that I'm here to support them, care for them, love them. That even if we're not actually related, we're still a family, a real family in all the ways that matter. If I can do that for them, then, well, then maybe I'm making this world a better place. I know you are. My predecessor taught me everything I know. I just took up his torch and ran with it, I guess. Uh, not that I'm anything close to what he was. Biggs is one of a kind. <gasps> oh no! I've completely lost track of time! Do you have somewhere you need to be? More like a dream I need to fulfill. Thank you again for your help. I wonder what kind of dream she's chasing tonight. No idea. Thanks again for saving our hideout from the king. In return, I let everyone know you guys can join the game as special guests. If you want to know more, then come to the hideout. <laughs>